Hello and welcome back to Transport Fever 2. It is good to be back guys. I have taken a month off, as you may have noticed, very much required. And uh, the house is a little bit quieter unfortunately. Uh, if you're wondering what that's all about, the start of this video was probably a little bit of a giveaway as well as uh, something I posted in the community section on the main channel. However, I'm not going to go on about what's happened in real life because that's something I've uh, always strived to do with the channel. It's a complete break from reality and uh, I do try and keep it that way where possible. So we're back and I intend to carry on with this. I, I got a little bit carried away with our uh, example of the update. It's not really a new update anymore so I'm possibly going to change the uh, the title of the uh, of the series. I've got our train coming in. This is a money train, isn't it? We need to get the UI up. Let's get the UI up really quickly here. See how much this is going to earn us. Oh, I clicked on the wrong thing. There we go. How much are you going to earn us? Are you going to earn us a boatload? Well, you just deducted some. That's not what we want to see. Oh, you empty? Or did I miss it? <laughs> you empty? You're empty. Oh, you plonker. I got all excited. I swear he had some stuff on him. I could be wrong. It's been it's been a month. <laughs> Maybe it just vanished over that month. That's not how transport fever works. All right. Hopefully we've got something going on up here money wise because we are, as you can see, very much in the red. I think we've already had a payday of all of our trains. No, there you go. You've got some on. What are you doing? You have someone as well. Yeah, you're waiting at the... Uh, how did I manage to click on the signal there instead of the train? Let's just take a look here. Oh, yes, you've got fuel on. I was hoping it wasn't some sort of bizarre bug there where we'd lost all of our stuff. But that isn't the case. No, we're good. It was just that one wasn't as exciting. Well, not this one. This one's going to be good for money. But this one wasn't as exciting as I thought it would be. No, we were empty, apparently. That would make sense if there's only 31 here. Yeah. Anyway, before I was uh, given false hope by having a load of money come in, I guess we best go up this end because there's nothing coming in for money-wise down there yet. We've got to wait for this guy to come down. Well, well this, this one. Who's going to get there first? Train 4. Is it train 4? Oh, dear. How do I keep getting that signal? Train, yeah, train four, or train two. We'll keep that one down there, and we'll uh, we'll see who's going to get there first. You've got to go and do the double helix, which is uh, going to take a while. We have another money train here, don't we? Yes. What about train three, Gran? Well, there you go. We're about to get some money from train three. We're going to need to pay off some debt. We are playing the actual game in this one, although it's only on uh, normal mode. Uh, so we will have lots to spend soon, which is the, the going to be the key to this, as I mentioned and then was interrupted. I'm going to change the name of the series to US Long Haul, possibly. It sounds good enough. It's a fictional place with some US town names, though so that's what I'm going to run with. But the uh, main reason I want to continue this and uh, how much we got? Let's pay off some of that loan. Yeah, the reason I want to continue this is... Let's just go over to my plan. Phoenix, I think I mentioned this. I would like a really big uh, central... Central-ish? It's not really central, is it? It's a little bit further... Uh, we're calling this south, are we? Palmdale's in the south, that's what we'll say. It's a little bit closer to the south than I'd like. But it's it's not far off centre, is it? Looking at it. No, it's not a million miles off. I think centre would be more where this massive um, hill range would be. Mountain range. No, hills. Hilly bit. Hill country. There we go. So yes, uh, the big plan is to build a massive freight exchange down here. Huge one. Uh, it's going to... It's going to bring stuff and import stuff down from the south. Not so much on this corridor. On the, uh, what would that be? Western side. 
No, but for the eastern side, it's going to be uh, pulling stu this stuff down and uh, sending stuff up as well. But only up to our uh, interchangey type thing here, a massive freight hub. So I'm looking forward to doing that. And uh, that's going to be the... Uh, are, you, are you on the way? Where are you? We've only just passed. Uh, the... What would this be? Providence. Yeah, the, you've only just passed, passed the Providence... Uh, oil well. Goodness me. It's a long old route, isn't it? I love this map. Oh, we've got some money to uh, repay. Abandoned industry. Right, let's pause that. We do have a bit of spending money, don't we? If we take out a loan. Yes. We never really addressed this. Uh, the previous... Well, the thing that interrupted... Oh, it vanished on its own? Okay. Well, it's, it's, <laughs> I was going to say, let's start at the bottom and work our way up and find it. But it's it's right there. I can see the timer. I believe that's changed. That used to be a year. Now it gives you, what, two years? That's a bit easier, isn't it? Yeah, the idea is to not let this close. Because the quarry would be quite handy, wouldn't it? For this Palmdale quarry up here. Is that what it's called? Uh, construction. Oh, it's not a quarry, you burk. Material. <laughs> Con mats. Factory. Guys, I need to get used to uh, being behind the mic again. Although it did feel kind of natural. Uh, it's been a while playing the actual game. I turned my PC off um, pretty much the day I wrote to the community uh, board thing. Messages. <laughs> what do you call it? Community tab on the channel yeah so my pc's been off for three weeks is that would that be about right somewhere around there but anyway we've got about two years to stop that from closing all we've got to do is ship i well actually i think all we've got to do is start taking stuff from here and it will stop this one closing these are easier to stop it's the production ones where you've got to deliver the end product, I think. Or act, no, you've just got to create it, haven't you? So, yeah, this is going to be fairly simple to create a line down here. Because all we'll do to start with is use trucks just to get it going. And feeding this with some stores might not be a bad idea. As long as we don't hook it up to Montgomery, which is where it will eventually go, we can... Uh, we can start storing some stone, I'm hoping. It shouldn't use it. That's the plan, anyway. So, yeah, should we get ourselves uh, a bit of a road network going down there? We can make use of the existing road. I don't think it's going to take two years to get down here. I don't, well, famous last words. But we'll set it up anyway. Yeah, let's do something. We've got to keep an eye on the money, so I'm going to pause it while we build. I would like to redo the bridge as well. We're not going to have anything too fancy to start with, and it will be replaced by a train eventually. So if we stick it this side, I think uh, that's roughly where our train's going to be. I'd probably like this to ship the stone down to... Not the stone, the con mats down to our, our hub here outside Palmdale. We could use this as some sort of transfer, couldn't we? I mean, the possibilities are endless. Which is the beauty of Transport Fever, isn't it? Yeah, you can do so many different things. Can we get a road down there? Possibly. If we bring this out, I'm going to keep it flat. We've got quite a bit of money to spend sorting out road networks and stuff. But I would like that to touch, ideally. You know what? Delete that. We'll start again. We'll do it ourselves. And we'll make it uh, nice and level along here and give ourselves enough room to build some roads off the side so if we do something like that yeah in the speed run i didn't care what it looked like but uh, now i'm back to some casual and relaxing building i really do care quite a bit okay curvy road it's actually fun playing transport fever again after a little break um not that it wasn't before <laughs> you know what I mean, I think. That's a better connection, isn't it? Do I know what I mean? Possibly not. I was getting a bit of burnout, is what I'm getting up there, I think. 
which is understandable. I've been doing it for over four years now. I think that's the longest break I've had in four years as well. Not planned, that's for sure. Yeah, should we redo this bridge? It's rubbish. I don't like that at all. That's naff. What well, in fact, what's up with that bridge? <laughs> that's, is that a bit... That's a bit broken, isn't it? Come on, transport fever. What are you doing? Just get rid of that. I feel like that might crush the game. Do we need this uh, river? It will be absolutely pointless setting up any sort of shipping along there, wouldn't it? Yes, so we'll get rid of that completely. It also means we don't need to worry too much about our height. So if we take it from this part of the bank, we should be okay. And uh, our trucks are a bit miserable on pulling power early on. So uh, it will help our trucks not have, not have to climb that ridiculous uh, humpback bridge it made there. Are we good there? You know, with terrible texture issues. Right, you go along there. Was that just a remnant of the beta, perhaps? I think it was, wasn't it? Because you've made this one rather nice. Yeah, in fact, that's, that is rather nice. How much is that going to cost us? Goodness me, it's pricey, but worth it. I'm going to say it's worth it anyway. We've also saved ourselves a little bit of a climb up here. Remember, we can take some money out. We're going to get paid quite a bit now. Our big long haul mainline thing, corridor, has, uh, has picked up speed. 52. All right, let's... Uh, Let's borrow some money. Why not? We're going to need to buy trucks as well. It is pause, so we're not going to lose any. I mean, on the flip side, we're not going to be earning any either. But we can always uh, accelerate time. That's a nice gentle slope, isn't it, up there? There we go. We have what we need. I'm not going to straighten this out just yet. I, I would just like it uh, I would just like it to be delivered. It does mean that I'd have to drive through town. I'm not overly keen on that. I don't know how much it would cost us to have sort of a, a bypass down here. I would like to change that road, though, down there. Uh, what's the top speed of our trucks? I don't think it's anywhere near the 37 miles an hour these roads allow. Yeah, well, we've got some down here, haven't we? I think they're 25, aren't they? Yeah, looking at it. Details. Uh, top speed, 25, yeah. So that would be perfect, wouldn't it? We don't really need to upgrade the roads because I think these uh, small country roads are indeed 25. Eventually, we will uh, keep this open. I want to see when it shuts down. This was not scheduled for today. I mean, the video was, but I forgot that we could have closing industries and I would like to uh, try and stop them from closing in this series. Yeah. This whole thing is going to be for our big uh, hub transfer, our freight hub over there. That That's what it's all designed for. To make us lots of money to be a little bit extravagant over there. Okay, now I think we're good. We've got that connection. We still need to connect this up, even though we could technically come across there, couldn't we? We could have some sort of triangle here. That might work. Because this will be reused when we no longer need trucks. Uh, to bring our stone in and when we can afford uh, a nice little shunt line. Well, it was quite a journey, but it's not a long haul journey, is it? Yeah, so we can reuse this, meaning for now we could have some sort of temporary road come down here. And if we keep it straight, we might be able to just hook into there. That's pleasant, isn't it? There we go, nice little triangle. You know I love my triangles. I don't know what sort of shape I'm making here. Oh yes, I do. our bypass isn't very bypassy, is it? No, it's a little bit just going straight into town at a different point. Ooh, we will get a, a sort of refund for that. I don't like the way that goes up anyway. Could we perhaps get rid of that, bring this back, get rid of that, and go kind of straight up to this point instead? I, we could go big road, and then the town could do that, couldn't it? Is that pleasant? It's 105k, but I, I think we're going to make plenty of money. Do we even go up much here? We don't. Let's continue this and as though the city was going to build there anyway, then we can have our bypass head up that way. And we can just use that for now. I don't like that bit there. 
No. We'll rebuild this for you, city, because you've made a weird kink in my road. And I don't like that. Put it like that instead. Oh, that's tidier, isn't it? Yeah, well, in fact, we'll come off at a better angle for you there as well. Make it nice and straight. Go into there. In fact, have a have a big road since you're heading off onto the, uh, the bypass there. There we go. We've got it. Right, and you continue your connection into the bypass there. Yeah, we're going to have a rail line. This one is going to continue there. Which is, it might be about the perfect place for it. I don't want to spend any money on it just yet. So we've got a connection. We'll leave that road there. No need to delete it just yet. I, don't, I like what you've done here. Very interesting. We're good, aren't we? We're absolutely good. Yeah. There we go. We'll get as much money as possible. So we'll keep our stations as far apart as possible. Meaning we'll tuck right in at the, uh, at the quarry here. Uh, I guess we don't need two sides either, do we? No, just have one side. Um, yeah, that should be fine. Oh, we could make even more money. I don't know whether it'll count this as extra distance, but if we go from right at the end there, that looks kind of pleasant, doesn't it? Yeah, there we go. We've got our two stations. Let's get a depot in. It doesn't matter where. For a moment there, I thought it was the... Uh, Tram depot. There are, I believe, freight trams on the workshop. Not something I've explored, really. They could be useful, couldn't they? Uh, for steep grades, definitely. Okay, line time. Let's get this uh, all hooked up. We'll keep this pinned at the side. I'm sure it's going to pretty much quit immediately. I don't know whether we've actually got to get it to the destination or whether it's just got to produce in this shipment bar new line we've only got three lines it's early days isn't it right yeah you got a fancy new color palette and everything now with the update i love it this will be the i guess palmdale stone haulage there we go right let's get our stations on here we'll start there and uh, i guess we'll wait until fall possibly we do want to take as much as possible, don't we? We kind of intersect with our own line there, but that's not really going to cause any issues either way. And uh, yes, wait till full and no maximum stop time. You, it's going to be not necessary, I don't think. In fact, uh, we're, we're not taking the full line rate down here. I, I don't think anyway. It, it's going to be tough to meet with our early trucks here. Palmdale West, uh, just drop off what you're going to drop off. It doesn't really matter what you do at Palmdale West. So, it is the West, isn't it? Yeah, it is. I think we worked that out, though, didn't we? By that being on the West of Palmdale. Yeah, that it's South and North. Don't have to remember. Palmdale South. <laughs> it's down there. Didn't even notice that. Are we good? Are we good to go? Should we buy some trucks and get them going? Uh, and we'll just buy what we got 446,000. That's the do the trucks are not that pricey, are they? Buy vehicles. What we got? Um, yes, the bends. Oh, yeah, we're not. There's no point taking the Mac, it can't even do 25 mile an hour. And definitely no return of the Mac here. Uh, oh, they're pricier than I thought. Look at me getting carried away. We don't want those, they can't take stone. How many can you buy? Five. Okay, they, they are much pricier than I thought. What are they, 85k each? Five kind of works though, doesn't it? Yeah, I like that. Buy those. We'll colour them, same colour as the stone line, and we'll stick you on our stone haulage. I think we've actually got a few more lines than that, haven't we? No, that is it. One of them is fuel delivery, isn't it? Which is the trucks. Cool, right. There we go, bit of a setup. I mean, we spent most of the time sorting out our... Where does that go? <laughs> I closed it, you plonker. So, we actually need to... Yeah, we've got to fill all these bars in for this to vanish. That's what I'm going to assume. Are you actually delivering? There we go. No, that's it. That's it. As long as it pops in there, that's all you need. It just hadn't started uh, producing yet and put it on the line. So now that it's on the line... 
Our Palmdale quarry here has been saved from closure. I mean, I don't blame them for closing. We weren't doing much with it, and apparently no one else was doing anything with it. Um, so what we got here? Planes? Are we going to deal with planes? We've certainly got the opportunity to, but I'm going with the long-haul rail here. We don't want competition from aircraft, do we? Oh, that'd be silly. So if not from us anyway, it'd be interesting if we did have to compete with aircraft. Given how the game works, we'd lose horribly because they'd pile up at the airport, even though they couldn't take it all. Right, how are we doing? Uh, not much has changed. We've still got this train coming through, haven't we? There we go, yep. Yeah. Down the dynamic passing loop. Yeah, thankfully, you've got a lot of fuel on board as well, haven't you? How are we doing on finances for this? It's starting to build up, isn't it? How much we're taking. But uh, 20 million we nearly hit there. Look at that. 1918, we had 19.8 million income. I love this bit. I know I said I'd probably move it down there. It's certainly an idea. I would like to get this fired up soon as well. The steel mill. Because we have iron ore there. And we have coal up here. Although, if we take a look at this coal, it's on a bit of a hill. Well, quite a bit of a hill, isn't it? It's raised up quite, quite a bit there. Goodness me. Well, in fact, we can uh, see how high it would be from the the track down there let's get the contours up the coal mine itself is at 50 57 meters and we've got that self-imposed grade restriction haven't we so we're gonna have to be careful down to 14 in quite a short distance as well i mean there's there's this bit we could go down we could have this sitting on the bank down here to join up and use existing track so we could get it up and running sooner and uh, we could take it down by truck couldn't we we'd still make money from it and uh, I know we're technically moving our station a bit further away from our other station which would be down that way somewhere so uh, it might be a bit cheaty that's an option should we see how much we're going to make on this I mean we've been watching it on and off on the way down train two you're currently losing us two million this year i mean are you just new no you've been making us quite a fortune haven't you that needs to be averaged out over like five years doesn't it for these long haul things anyway get in here make us some money how much are you going to make us an absolute fortune i hope 118 fuel brought all the way down from the north end of the map is it going to be uh, enough to pay off some of our loan again. Yeah, you're going to be stopping up here, aren't you? I love these trains, though. They're absolutely lovely, aren't they? What is it? Mercado? Are these Mercados? I don't know. How much? Was that 8 million? Well, I ain't going to say no to that. I've got no choice, but I'm not going to. 8 million. Goodness me. Well, that paid for our little uh, stone haulage thing we've got going now. Thank you for that. That was pleasant. Oh, I only noticed these uh, have kind of a, a bow in them, don't they? Yeah, that's kind of nice. Details. It is a Mikado, isn't it? Let's have a look. Yes, 282 Mikado. Right then, how's our trucking going over here? You, you, oh dear, we've got even more money and a new industry. Montgomery Oil Well. Montgomery, we're not really doing anything with you just yet. No, I don't know what you, you'd be used for. I mean, we've got another oil well down here, but anything we can do with oil? We've got plastic, but that needs to be refined first. So let's hope that we, uh, well, I mean, we could ship it up north, couldn't we? And bring the refined all the way back down. That would be kind of interesting. We've got another oil well there. The refineries were a bit short on. I think they're all up north. I mean, it would be the perfect aircraft situation, except we wouldn't be able to carry much, but it would be possible. Our other refinery is there. We've got this one that we're using. We've got the one up near Beaumont. And yeah, well, that's a toughie. Oh, I do like dynamic industries. That was a good addition, wasn't it? Oh, what are you doing, you silly sausage? Pause that. Let's repay things because we want... 
our uh, interest payments to be as small as possible. Could we uh, throw another truck on here quickly? Because it's going to make us money, isn't it? Yeah, and they're like 80k, weren't they? 84? There you go. We'll stick a couple more on there. This is going to be a profit uh, maker for us, isn't it? A money earner. We've got another iron mine down here as well. And uh, lots of coal and more iron. Goodness me. Yeah, we're flush with coal and iron around here. I sort of like this setup. These two here, because we've got an existing line that I'd like to build into. Hopefully we've got enough time to um, make a, uh, the money to get this up and running, because it's going to be rail all the way down to our Palmdale steel mill there, before these start threatening closure, because that would be awful. I like the idea of that. I certainly like the idea of running it down here uh, via truck, because yeah, you don't really have the option to have a conveyor system going down the hill, do you? And set up a, a, a station down closer to the level of our, our line here. And this is nice and flat down here. I think we could find a nice place for it to sit as well along this embankment. It saves a, a, a strange climb up there. It wouldn't be too bad, but when you're limited on grade, it could get a bit uh, ugly, perhaps. Or nice. <laughs> depending which way you look at it. I think we're alright on this. This is going to be double tracked soon. We're not really holding anything up, I don't think. It's more that we're a little unbalanced at the moment on where uh, each of our trains sit. And, oh yeah, don't we... St no, I did it, I did it. I was going to say, don't we have to rebuild this and dub to double track it, but I did do it, didn't I? It was like the last thing we did. Um, yeah, so we could extend our double tracking. Where is... Oh, I love this. I actually do love that a lot. I, I don't think we're getting rid of this, guys. The interesting thing is, given the grade limitations now, will we be able to upgrade it? Yeah, okay, so it should ignore that. We could rebuild it and fix it to the grade. Right, pause that. We've got four point, well, nearly five million, shall we say, there. Uh, more double tracking, what do you reckon? Because I'd like to get this double tracked all the way. Possibly leave it single tracked at the tunnels. That would, that would make sense in real life, wouldn't it? Especially this long one. Until, uh, until we could afford it later on. But we can possibly afford double tracking all the way down up to this little tunnel here. Yeah. As long as it's actually going to do it down here. I'm not sure on the grades down this section, but I think it's fairly, fairly decent compared to the everywhere else, really, that we had to uh, adjust. Oh, we've got, we've got catenary. I don't think we're going to deal with electrics much early on. I think I'm going to stick with the, uh, with the steam, big steamy boys. That's what I'd like, uh, rather than rather than electrics. Right, what's our maximum speed in the Mercado? I mean, it's 50. If I it, if it can get 75 without it looking too awful, I'll take it. It's, it's not bad, actually. No, it's not bad at all. It's a long old, <laughs> it's a long old junction, but yeah, I'll take it. Turn out of the century there. Right, let's get our US signal. Oh, guys, I just realized. Well, wait, I thought it was 1925 you get electrics. Must be 1920 then? Maybe? 1925 is when the roads upgrade, isn't it? And we get a uh, high speed track. Yeah, we're not, we haven't got high speed track yet. But since we haven't done much signaling, we can at least start putting these. Uh, these new US signals in. There we go. We've figured out how to do lights, guys. What do I want out here? It does tell you here a little bit about the signal and what it's used for. So we could maybe use the correct ones. Use the junction as a normal path signal to regulate traffic or as a one-way signal. So something like that. Uh, this would be possibly blocking. I, I feel like that's not really required facing this way because there's only one option isn't there we would be using these just to uh, regulate the junction here or the turnouts turn-ins 
<laughs> we'll be turning in. Uh, should we go with that? Yeah, and we do want them one way. There we go. We've got uh, our first little signal there. Looks a bit pink, oddly. Are you really pink? Maybe. Uh, we can replace the old ones then, can't we, as well? We can get these semaphores gone in places. I'll leave the... I'll leave the junction like that, though. That'll be fine. We need to get rid of this one anyway, because we're going to be draw joining this bit of track up. So let's get you joined up. There we go. We can get some blocking in between. We might need it. We go halfway-ish, can't we? And just have a couple of these blocking. Uh, one there. And uh, would you have it back to back or facing each other? I don't feel like you'd have them facing each other. I'm going to go back to back, I think, or, or possibly level. Does it matter? Just put it in, Grand. It's a, it's a signal. <laughs> I kind of just like it like that, though. I don't know. That looks pleasant, doesn't it? There we go. Uh, that's not halfway, but we're up to, well, we'll stick some more in. I don't know where our trains are going to be and what we're going to be adding here. So sometimes they might be a bit skew whiff on where they join. So you want as much blocking as possible, but we're not going to go overboard with it, obviously. We'll get one, yeah, halfway between there, roughly, like that. I've done them all sorts of different. <laughs> At first, I was, like, taking my time to separate them correctly or face them or have them back to back. And then I just plonk them in next time around. Why not? Uh, we'll have some more of those, I think. I like them. Yeah, replace that signal as well. Uh, they might be better on here now. Oh, yes, I could show you these uh, gantry systems. We could have a gantry system here because uh, then we haven't got this like leaning over. I'm sure it would be fine like that. But can we make it with the with the little gantry things? Because uh, that would be cool to show you. Let's get... Uh, I can't remember where they are. I think they're in here. Then assets. Then we need trackside assets. Here they are. It'd be something like that, right? That leans over. It doesn't matter which way. I don't, it would matter, wouldn't it? Uh, something like that, perhaps? We could have it in the middle. We'll see where the uh, signals sit on it, and whether it makes sense or not. Would that sit on that side? So it's, this is more like part of the station. Yeah, that that would be kind of nice, wouldn't it? You sit there like that. Yeah, it looks like you're kind of part of the platform there. And uh, it depends where we all sit. On, on top of this. I don't know which ones of these we would possibly use. Used as a, a normal pass signal, yeah. It's a bridge mount. It's not really a bridge, is it? I feel like that is the, the one of choice, though. Let's see. Because uh, you want to be that way. That doesn't look right. Or does it? Would it stick out like that? I, I feel like it wouldn't. <laughs> that doesn't make much sense. But what, they're too big as well. What on earth goes on top of these, guys? Is it those? Oh, they're facing a, a more different way. But they're over... That's, what is that? No, that's for the big big uh, tower things, isn't it? Um, I feel like it should be those, but they, they don't look right. Guys, which one am I supposed to put on here? Is it these? Are they supposed to, like, hover over the edge somehow? Or have I just got completely the wrong thing here? Does that work? Looks a bit scary, doesn't it? A bit hovery. <laughs> I guess it's just nailed or bolted in at that end. I mean, it. Yeah, sure, we'll leave that in. We'll have that there. That's fine. Yeah, there we go. That took far too long. We'll get into the gantry things once we uh, get up this end and we've got a lot of freight maneuvers going on. Uh, with a lot of junction work. There's going to be plenty going on down here. We'll get some nice gantries with uh, all those other signals you saw, but we'll use the, the proper bridge-type gantry, I guess it would be called. And, uh, yeah. So we'll leave it there. Now, let's pay that off. I think when we come back, then, it's time to start setting up some of that junction I was talking about just then. And... Uh, get this hooked up at Palmdale Steel Mill. I think we could start making our way down there. Before I commit that, how how high are we? We're only 14 metres. And how high is this? 
Well, that's only at seven. We've got seven meters to go all that way. I think and we kind of can wiggle, can't we, down there? We could definitely work that. I will try and get this uploaded to the workshop. I don't know what was up with it before. I haven't tried since. So maybe whatever was up with it has been resolved. Uh, are you... Are you paying? Oh, yes, you are, aren't you? You're on the way back. Yeah, there we go. Right. We are playing. We are making money again. And you're on your way back. You are... Where's, where's our other one? You are on the way in. We've now got a lot more double tracking, so a lot less waiting, depending on how our trains sit. Um, what do we want to ride on? I guess we'll ride on that. All right, guys, thank you for watching. We're on board, heading to... We've got no fuel on board. Look at that, so we're running empty. We're on board our fuel train that's fuelless, and we're going to go under our really extravagant signal for, for one signal like a whole gantry thing for it it will make more sense later on we'll probably turn it into an actual uh, a bridge type gantry it looks all right though doesn't it it sort of does a job i like that we haven't got like a pole sat in the middle of the track there that's that to me it looks okay just pretend it's not hovering on a couple of planks of two by four well, it's not even two by four is it no right guys it is great to be back recording. I, I'm going to slowly get into uh, getting back up to speed. I'm going to take my time a little bit. And uh, get the feel of things again. Still got to edit this yet. That will be a little bit lonely because uh, I won't have my snoring puppy at my feet, unfortunately. And uh, while that did make some editing interesting. <laughs> because I didn't know whether it was actually on the recording or... Or uh, Sammy snoring like an old man. But I still miss it, nonetheless. <sighs> Guys, when we come back then, shall we get that steel mill hooked up? Some, some junction work done. Some of that gantry work done as well. Plenty of signals. Uh, I'll try and look up what signals are supposed to have. Or if you already know, drop a comment below. And then uh, I'll use your wisdom. Rely on your wisdom. To uh, get us looking fairly realistic. And until then. Take care.